How's it going everybody? In this video I'm going to cover how to set up a flight plan using the working title G1000 NXI. Uh, except now we have version 0.2, so we now have the added ability to input airways. So tap down to the MFD like last time. And we'll start setting this up. So we'll go to the flight plan button to open the flight planning page. We'll scroll down to this blank line underneath origin, which is just the header. So on the blank line, we'll enter our origin and we'll activate the keyboard functionality. And that's noted by this blue dot up here. If we click again, you can see it's not highlighted, so I can't type anything. Uh, but with it highlighted in blue, we'll type in KMMH for Mammoth Yosemite. Press enter, and now it'll ask us if we want to select a runway. Uh, we can either enter a runway or leave it blank, so let's leave it blank for now. Press enter. Now we can either enter the en route section or destination next. Uh, order shouldn't matter. I like to set the destination next just as a preference. So do this the same way as the origin. Make sure the keyboard's active, and then we'll type in. Eagle County, press enter, and once again we can either select a runway or leave it empty, I'll leave it empty again. And now we'll move down to the en route section, so we'll bring, the, bring up this page using the inner knob, activate the keyboard, and enter our first fix, which is the Oscar Alpha Lima VOR, press enter. There we go. And now instead of entering our next fix, what we can actually do is press menu, scroll down to load airway, and it actually defaults to load airway right now. And we'll press enter. Now at the top, it'll show that our entry is the VOR that we just entered. Now we have to define the airway we want to use. So we'll use the inner knob to scroll down to Tango 298, press enter, and now we have to define the exit of the airway, so we'll use the inner knob, and we'll scroll to our exit, which is Detton, press enter, and now you can see all the fixes are automatically added between our entry of OAL and exit of Detton, so we'll scroll down to load, and there we go. Uh, now, to enter our next fix, we would scroll down to here, uh, but if you get kind of a long uh, route, you can collapse this down. So we go to Menu, Collapse, Airways, Enter. So now it's a lot easier to scroll up and down without all those fixes there. Uh, so now our next point is going to be going direct to Hammett. Enter. Now that the blank line below Hammett's selected, we can press Menu, Load Airway, and the only airway here is Victor 244, which is the one we want. Now we have to define our exit, which is going to be the Hotel Victor Echo VOR. There we go. Press Enter on Load. So now we've got our next airway down here. We'll scroll down to the blank line, and instead of entering another fix, we can actually just uh, use this exit from our last airway, so we'll go to Menu, uh, Load Airway, and now it will automatically detect the last fix in our en route section, which is the exit of the previous airway. Now we just have to choose our airway from there, which is the Victor 8. Low altitude airway. And now our exit is going to be Uftar Uftu. There we go. Hit enter again. Scroll down to load and enter. So there we go. Now we've got our whole route planned. Uh, if we want, we can expand this again. So we'll go to menu 
expand airways. We can scroll through and see all of the fixes that we did not have to enter manually. Uh, last part of setting up this plan, we can go to procedure, select a departure, and we'll go with nickel 2. Runway, you can choose 27 or runway 9, we'll take 9. We'll hit load. So now we can see we've got our departure airport, departure procedure right here. And then here we begin the en route section. So we've got our OAL VOR, then using this airway to Deton. So scroll us down, there's Deton. Another en route section starting at Hammett using this airway. Ends at Hotel Victor Echo VOR. Then we start another airway off of that exit. And then ending at of 2 and then ending up at our destination. And if we want to double check this, we can either scroll out like this. You can see it goes out to Colorado, or Colorado as they would say in Colorado. Uh, the other way is that uh, also with version 0.2, we can go to menu, map settings, and we can change the map from heading up to track up or north up. So we'll go just like that. Let's close that. Uh, so now you can see the map is north up, and we can scroll out and also see where our flight plan is taking us. So that's pretty much all you need to know about setting up a flight plan using the now 0.2.0 version of the working title G1000 NXI for Microsoft Flight Simulator. Thanks.